this book serves as a very important social document of, of um, you know, what, what California was like in the, the early and mid-1960s, uh, what Paris was like during the uh, student revolt, uh, what different parts of Ireland were like in, in, in the 60s, 70s and 80s. In the mid-1960s, I had the privilege and pleasure of teaching in Berkeley and also living in Paris. So I spent half the year in Berkeley and the other half in Paris. And uh, as I began teaching in Berkeley, I realized that, that there was a whole student revolution going on. And there was an extraordinary atmosphere of energy. And of course, free love was across the campus. And uh, this was something that we, that, we, that we weren't used to in the north of Ireland. It was a lovely, easy life. It seemed like the Garden of Eden. On the Berkeley campus, you had about 28,000 people who uh, seemed to be enjoying themselves. And uh, there was a great energy in the air. And also music in the background. There's a wonderful description of, of Norman Mailer, Dylan Thomas and Brandon Bean um, together uh, as those tight Roman men with small feet. Uh, and you suddenly realise in that the opening up of a whole new set of connections between, between these three writers, and not just in their physical appearance, but also uh, somehow in their essence. There are absolutely brilliant descriptions in the book um, of, of John Berryman, of, of Gary Snyder, of, of Patrick Kavanagh, um, of, of John Hewitt. Uh, and the pleasure which I think lies ahead of um, all of you uh, lucky readers um, it is uh, summed up, I think, in a phrase that John uses in the book about, about Hewitt, um, where he refers to Hewitt as tender and comprehending. Um, and it's a perfect description in itself, I think, of the way in which uh, John describes uh, his encounters. I had to describe that period of my life. Um, I was brought up as a little um, um, Ulster Catholic boy and I'd been plunged into a, into a sea of cheerful pleasures. So I had to deal with that. Uh, I had to make sense of it. <laughs>